Well, time to get our, our uh, slaughter of the SSN, I suppose. After all, we can't leave until we knock everyone out. I want the EXPs! I needs them! All of them. No depending on how long it takes us to get to the rival fight and pick up cut, maybe I'll take care of the trainers in Lieutenant Surge's gym. I don't know, though I admit that would make for an awkward episode if it was just literally him all by his, his lonesome. Though I'll admit picking up uh, experience from all the trainers in there might be a bit annoying too. Okay, we want to make sure we pick up rest before we leave. Ah, uh, max push was I was looking for, but I'll take it. At least it's valuable. Sailor's pride's at stake, why? I'm not sure why, why it's on stake, but okay. Take care of the horsey. Then you gotta take care of the shelter. And we'll be have to go back to the uh, Pokemon Center before we can get to the rival. I don't know. Take care of the tentacle, because, you know, easy target. And now I'll take care of the sailor. May I try some more body slams around here? Of course, I know one of these sailors has magic carbs. Ugh. Well, let's see what we got. Well, it's not this sailor. Though, maybe I'm thinking of a different game. Oh, man, when you spend as much time as I have on Pokemon games, they sometimes blur together a bit. <laughs> like, like, I know there's a sailor somewhere that has a magic carb, right? Like, yeah, but is it this game I'm thinking of, or am I thinking of uh, Gen 3? Do you now? You like feisty kids that break into your room and knock out all your Pokemon. Weird. I would not think that'd be something that someone would want to encourage. Seriously? You couldn't knock it out with 15 levels of advantage with one hit. That's just sad. Oh, man. Another seismic toss. Well, we'll just T-bolt this one, because I'm tired of taking hits. Apparently, if I want to one-shot people with a uh, bias them, I need more levels. Ugh. Not really what I was looking for, but I'll take it. Okay. Yeah, I know you sailors have Pokemon. I've been knocking them out left, right, and center. Okay, another acid-spewing tentacle. Well, might as well frag it before I can, you know, shoot the acid. Ah! I guess he's the star sailor, you know? Because he's got a star you. Star. Boom. Yeah, I know, it was obvious before I even tried to explain it. Okay, sweet, we got a copy of Rest. Will we be able to actually use that? Uh, maybe? I mean, if we combine it with Double Team, we could probably pull off a Rest. I mean, maybe we'll switch into, like, Double Team... Uh, rest and Toxic for the Rival Battle. For the final one. You know, just so we can be a complete dick to him, you know? Like, here you go, rival. Eat toxic, you know, and then slowly die. Speed is not my problem, man. I get far more boosts out of double team. Like, way more. Ugh. 
power point count, man. I should have seismic tossed the shelter. Well, that'll take care of that fisherman. Sorry, I don't know why I call him a sailor. Sailor's back here. Walking the plank. This ship even has a plank? A diving board, maybe, but surely not a plank. Paralysis, kick in, please. Ugh. Like, I got the paralysis, but it didn't stop it from attacking. Which is what I was hoping for, damn it. Well, nothing else that way. How many I got left, anyway? We might want to go, yeah, heal up. Then come back, deal with the rival, pick up cut. Then head to Surge's gym, maybe? I don't think there's going to be enough time left, though. After all, it's going to take us a hot minute at least to get back to the Pokemon Center. And yeah, I know, some people find ways to cut around actually healing here so they can use Dig or whatever to get back to Cerulean, but... I really don't care for those little time-saving tricks. I'm not here to, you know, speedrun the game. Like, this isn't a speed competition here. It's a, can we do this effectively? And I think, you know, going slow sometimes has its benefits. So you don't have to spend as much time, like, resetting, you know? Because the fight didn't go well. Though we're probably still gonna end up double-teaming on his, uh, first Pokémon. After all, might as well badge boost, right? I don't think there's anything else over here. No, we went down that one thing earlier, so yeah, this should be the final battle, basically. Ugh. Yep, nothing. Come on, rival. Let's do this. Oh, man, I started trying to be a snooty Frenchman. What's next? You gonna tell us you already got one? And by got one, I mean the Holy Grail. You know, Monty Python reference, uh, quest for the Holy Grail. Okay, let's, uh, double team. Sweet, more badge boosting. I love it. And more. He's so hesitant to peck us, man. Oh, finally a, an attack move. Problem is, it was Fury Attack and way too late. Okay. Time to finish you off. You're no longer useful. Well, that'll take care of that. Give it a body slam. And that's the body slam that killed a rat. Because we'll never see it again. Critical hit. And out comes Eevee. Just to get hit with a body slam. Oh, I'll take care of that. Don't you mean I'm raising a Pokemon? Like, yeah, I know we ha technically have, you know, a Charmander, but we're not doing anything with it. Well... Gotta give him a back rub. No, if he has seasickness, why on earth is he a captain of a boat? Like, that doesn't seem like a good combination, you know? He's like, I'm out at sea and I'm getting sick and just puking everywhere. 
Well, time to get off this shit. For the last time. Come on, feet, carry me faster. I so miss the mud running shoes. Such a time saver, man. Well, time to watch her sail off into the sunset. And she's going, slowly but surely. Ugh, last smokestack. And she's gone, like all your money in South Park. Well, that'll do it for this episode. Next time, you know, we'll uh, deal with Lieutenant Surge. Until then, see ya.